Has one. anybody else noticed anything about me today? You've had a shave again? You've got nope. a different T-shirt on that you haven't worn for ages. You've got I've, one of our T-shirts I've got a Chris Moyle Show oh, T-shirt yeah. on. yeah. Which I don't think I've ever Have worn before, yeah. And I think one of the reasons for this is they've never really fit me. Mm. We In the five years we've done the show, we've we've gone through a, 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 quite a, a range of T-shirts. Yeah. Which we've had printed for, for different events. But today's one is uh, from when we went to Bristol. I don't know how long ago that is. Two years ago? More than that, Three I think. Ago. Is that when we did a karaoke evening there? We did something there. I don't know what we did. But we did a gig in Bristol. And yeah, so it's a Chris Moore show. There it is, look. Yeah, it was yeah. when we were on at 7 oh, o'clock look, in the yeah. morning. 7 so till 10 on 7 the 7 till 10. Yeah. yeah. When was that? When did we start? And I found it the other day and I just thought, do you know, is it weird if I wear a Chris Moyle Show t-shirt? Is, is it a bit like Damon Albarn wearing a Blur t-shirt? Is that, that's not that No, I don't bad, think so. It? It's okay. You didn't make the t-shirt, did you? It's not no, as you've gone and away I've, and, and made I've never, it. I've never worn any of the Chris Moore Show t-shirts because, as a, I'm genuinely, because they've never fit. Mm. I think I wore a mouldy-looking stain t-shirt. Yeah, well, that was a cool t-shirt. Well, yeah. The MLS. The MLS. Do you know, the other day, when we had an office clear-out, I found loads of old t-shirts. We have made a lot of them in our no, time. And do you know what? We should have sold them. We missed well, a mm. trick. I was thinking at some point we ought to send Alleds out again. And just give the rest away. Has anybody on the show got a T-shirt from every time we've had one printed? Most Pretty much. Of them. Pretty much. Yeah. Have you? Yeah. Do you remember when we went I'm to Norwich any. and it, it was just say Norwich, just oh, say no? Do you remember I that one? Got any of them? Really? I've, I've got that. Home. Have you? Yeah. yeah. I've got none. No, of them. I haven't. And do you know what? I remember asking in the first kind of like year, mm. or the first with the first couple of batches. I remember saying, "Can you just keep one for me, Al?" It's like, yeah, 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 yeah. And I remember he'd go and give some away. Yeah. And I'd go, "Have you got a T-shirt for me?" Yeah, we've only got smalls. No, we've only got medium. And I'm like, well, that's, that's no good. Mm. My mum's got a big weekend T-shirt from every year for the last ten years. Has she? Yeah. I'm just almost certain. She's I've like, got a celebrity Tarzan everyone. T-shirt as well, I have. Have you? Yeah. Actually, do you know what? Sophie used to sleep in a celebrity Tarzan yeah, T-shirt. Yeah, Nick did too. They were green, I think, weren't they? Yeah, they were. They were very good for sleeping in. Yeah. We've got some of those upstairs. Celebrity Tarzan? Yep. How could we got them? Because it's kind of like, well, you know me, I'm just like, we'll keep a few of those. And then I forgot they were there. Has anybody got any of our t-shirts? Please give us a text. 81199. I found a Roy Walker legend one the other day. Ah, yes. And Black and white one. I've got that one. And yeah. also, do you remember when we had Mark Lawrenson on the show record, um, reading the sport? Yeah. I've got a Mark Lawrenson legend t-shirt too. Oh God, I, I remember that. doing one of those. I found they, them all the other That day. must have been ironic. They must have been strictly limited edition. Yeah, yeah. they were just... Yeah, to one. Made by him. <laughs> <laughs> um... All right, well, there you are. 8 of Wonderful Nine, if you have any of our uh, Chris Moore Show t-shirts. We used to get them made up when we used to go to gigs. And they must be collectible. <laughs> Definitely. I like the Bristol one, though. I, I kind of like it. It mm. just says, for those of you who can't see, it says, everything in Bristol is whatever. Hmm. Which was a joke. It's a weird t-shirt, because it was a joke. Uh, we said to Alan, do you know those Kaiser Chief ones? Like, uh, everything is brilliant in Leeds. We should get do one similar, which is like, you know, everything in Bristol is, you know, well, well, whatever. whatever. Mm. And then the joke was, we went on stage wearing a t-shirt and said, everything in Bristol is whatever. And he, it was a literal that thing, was you see? Yeah, that was the it joke. It was kind of funny. Yeah, words well, a treat, though. <laughs> and, um, it was but humor. now I end up wearing a t-shirt saying, everything in Bristol is whatever, so I don't really... But... It's a milestone. Whereas Dave was wearing a, a Mr. Men t-shirt. Now... That's nice. Which one is that? Mr. Grumpy. Mm, how appropriate. Oh. Why do you have to ask? What? Above the fact it says Mr. Grumpy. I couldn't on see it. because his coffee cup. It's also was... a grumpy face. Well, but he could look. I think he looks a bit like Mr. Topsy Turvy. Is he not a similar colour to that one? No. Your coffee cup was hiding the name, so I could. I saw Mr. But I you thought it was who? Topsy Turvy man. Mr. Topsy Turvy apparently. Apparently. Mr. Topsy Turvy, as everyone knows, not apparently, mm. he's a different colour. Fact. Oh. Is he? Mm. Yeah. What, what colours? And he's round, because happy Mr. Men are always kind of round in shape, whereas the angry ones are angular. Is that true? Angular. I think M so. Mr. Strong Square. I yeah. thought oh, that yeah. Mr. Topsy Turvy was was only round on his top bit. Doesn't it sort of go... He has go... a little hat, doesn't he? I'm going to find oh. out. I don't know. I just spelled Turvy. T-U-R-V-Y. Brilliant. Uh, Dick... Pardon? He's watering flowers in London in the rain. He <clears> says, D do Nick and Sophie, in fact, sleep in the same Tarzan T-shirt? Um, listen, um, They don't do Dick, 
share thing. No, yeah, stop trying to get an image of yeah. Dom's wife and my lady in huddling up together with the duvet in one big Cut out your, your wag fantasies. Although yeah. they probably could with my old t-shirt. Mr. Topsy Turvy is orange and has an upside down hat. Hence, I think, the topsy turvy bit. Mr. What, uh, what, look at me. Don't look at the screen. Look at me. What colour is Mr. Nosy? Red. Wrong. Is he? Yeah. What is he? Blue. He's green, isn't he? Is he? Is he? I'll tell That's you in a minute. Guess. He's got a big nose. Mr. Red is strong. Mr. Small is yellow. Mr. Red is strong. Mr. Strong, Mr. strong is red. Sorry, Mr. Strong is red. You're Mr. Right. Nosy is green. Thank you. Mm. I know that. And Mr. Bump, what colour is Mr. Bump? Blue. With and white bandages. That's yeah. right. Blue and white. He's not blue and white, he's blue. Now, is Mr. Tickle yellow or orange? Orange. Orange. I thought he was red, isn't he? <laughs> which is the orange. yellow one? He's orange. Thank you. Mr. Which, Tickle. Which is the yellow one? Mr. Mr. Happy. Or Mr. Happy. Okay. Mr. Small just looks like Mr. Happy, but smaller. Mm. Mr. Is happy is yellow. Yeah, we just said this. Sorry. Um, <laughs> and by the way, fact... Watch this from me doing a Darren Brown mind prediction. I want everybody listening now to think of their favourite Mr. Man. And I'm going to tell you who it is. And when I said it la uh, correctly, be honest, send a text going, oh my God, you were right. Okay? okay. If everybody thinks their favourite Mr. Man, I will then say who everybody's favourite Mr. Man is. Okay. okay you ready? Mm. So I've got some mystic music on. Mm -hmm. My yeah. phone's off about five minutes ago. Mystic Man. Music. Mystic Man. <laughs> mystic Man. I'm not sure. I don't ready? Know, Just think of who you... Thank you for your favourite win is. Yep. And when you've done that, just say you're ready. Okay, ready. Lock in your answer. Mm. So like it's locked. Sure. Ready. ready. Locked. locked. Ready. Yeah. Locked. You've done it, Rach? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Lock in your answer. Your favourite Mr. Man is... Mr. Bump. No! Yes! No! No! I wrote it down. High I five. was going to go with Mr. Messi and I changed High at the last minute. Tick. High five. High five. I there. said Mr. There Tickle. Mystic friend. Yeah, no. you're wrong. Well, no, Mr. I'm not. Mr. Noisy's mine. Yeah, you're wrong. Yeah. 8 double, one, double, nine. If I, if I got it right, then send me a text now. Yes. Come on. You two. I'll, I'll tell you the secret. That was brilliant. That. How'd you do that? That was brilliant. What? I can't give away my secrets. I'm like Darren Brown. Ooh. I think you feel sorry for Mr. Bump. Sleep Bunk. with me. <laughs> what? Yeah, everyone feels sorry for Mr. Bump. He's very clumsy, isn't he? Mm. A few people say, no, you're wrong. Not as clumsy as Mr. Clumsy. Oh, but, yeah. uh... Oh, my God, Chris, you're right. Here we go, you ready? Mm. Lee in Halifax. Yep, mine was Mr. Bump. Eleanor from Swansea says, oh, my God, you were right. How the hell did you do that from Steve? Oh my god, you're right, says Dan the Trucker. Alex in Chester. Joe in Shepparton. Uh, see? Jackie in Wiltshire. Jess in Devon. So Mr. Bump's most people's favourite. Yeah, it is. That's the is that in the same way that, that Darren Brown, I think, does a trick where he says that he can predict what year it says on your 20 pence piece? And then two. people. Pardon? 82. Yes, and that's because there was loads of them made in 82. In fact, they might even have started in 1982. Yeah. So statistically, he knows that there's a lot of them. Let me have a look. I'll, I'll have a look. If you're dr if you're not driving, have a look in your pocket. 20 well, pence, not No, what? not 20 pence. What? Oh my pence. Goodness. 20 pence? Coin. Oh, I don't think so, dear. Uh, what is it, Dave? <laughs> 1982. How no, rude. What, what is it? 20 pence? <laughs> That's it. What's that name? Coin. coin. Right. <laughs> We've had this before. Coin. coin. You can't say coin. coin. Yeah, I can. Coin. A 20 coin. pence coin. 20 pence coin. Dave, coin. you're bang on. Thank you. Mine is 1982. I there told you. you. And hang on, I, I was the one who said the year. He never said the year. Oh, didn't he? No, I did. Chris, you're bang on. No, it means the pair of us have oh, a special you're, power. You're both bang on. Hey, we could do a memory show together. Do you know what? That'd be great. Right, you and I get really drunk one night and you just go, nudge me in the pub and you go, Guess the year on, on the 20 pence mm. piece in Dominic's pocket. And I go, that is the date two. And you go, correct. I'm going to the toilet. <laughs> you walk up. And Dominic's in there going, what a bunch of drunken losers. I mean, really sick. Oh my God, it's 1982. Mm. I'm very impressed with that. Thanks so much. If you've got a 20 pence piece with no date on it, then it's worth a fortune. Oh, Isn't Jane's it? brother found one of them the other day. Really? Did yeah, he? yeah. As, well, he should hold on to it, because it's worth a lot of money. He is going to. He's looking on, on, online to see how much it was worth. Yeah. <laughs> they were selling for five or six grand. Could you No, imagine? they were. Yeah, they were. On, 50 on the, quid, I heard. No, no. 50 quid from the Royal Mint. You can give it to the Royal Mint, and they'll, and they'll have it for 50 quid. Turn or, it in. They were going on certain auction sites. Five grand? Yep. Yeah. 
I'm going to start looking Ring for him now, Dave. Tell him we'll give it, tell him we'll give him 200 quid 200 for it. 200 quid. <laughs> tell, him, tell him he gets 50 quid from the Royal Mint, but we'll give him 200 pounds. Yeah. Exactly. Because we want it for the show. Cash back. You're, I'll go halves with you. Are oh, you fine? <laughs> what? Hang I'll go, on. I'll go halves. Okay. I'll give you 100 quid. You oh, I'm with quid. you, yeah. That's 200 quid. Yeah. Halves, Dave. And then we get five grand. That's right. Big and then, ones. And then we have half each. Which How much would we have? 2,500 each. Yeah, but I want my 100 back. So I get 2,600. Right, perfect. Half each. Now, uh, it's 6.48.